Joining us now for the final trade of the day is Russell Rhodes of the Chicago Board Options Exchange, here to talk about unusual options trading in McDonald's. Thanks for coming on the show. Well, I'm always happy to be here. This is a huge earnings week, and mm -hmm. McDonald's is a big Dow component. It's a big Dow component. It's a big S&P component. So what do you think about the stock? What are the, uh, what's the options market really? The option here? The, the option market's actually pricing in a, a bullish surprise. We've seen more bullish than bearish activity. Uh, on average, the stock usually moves up or down about 2%. Uh, saw a couple of trades that had break-evens up around 25 or 3%, so uh, more bullish than the average move. Uh, not a whole lot of bearish activity in McDonald's. Why do you think that is? Uh, I think maybe, you know, the stock has been on quite a run and nobody wants to get in front of something like that. I was looking at the chart on it and it's, I, I didn't realize how much of a leader it has been this year. Uh, typically, uh, stocks start to discount news and they discount news with momentum. Uh, the, the stock has momentum and I bet you the, the news flow has probably got positive momentum as well. So what would be some price targets that the options market is predicting here? Uh, I saw a price target up around uh, 160 or so, which is about a 5% move from where the stock was trading on Monday when this trade went off. There was a, a trade that basically cost about 80 cents that would profit for just a, a little bit over $4 if the stock moves up to 160. That actually would be a new all-time high as well. So they're not only are they expecting the stock to move higher, they're actually expecting a breakout from the stock as well. So traders feeling the Big Mac here. Exactly. They're loving it. Thanks for We're going to try to outdo each other. <laughs> <laughs> Time for us to go. Thank you, though. You betcha.